here's a puzzle. Google's appears to have started work on a completely new operating system, but no one knows quite what it's for. The project name is Fuchsia, and it currently exists as a growing pile of code on search giant's code depository and on GitHub too. The fledging OS has a number of interesting features, but so far Google has yet to comment on its intended function. All we really know is that this looks like a fresh start for Google, as the operating system does not use Linux kernel, a core basic code that underpins both Android and Chrome OS. The name of project has emerged after code reading Pink plus Purple, that is Fuchsia, a new operating system. And other references have appeared on the company's code depository and on GitHub. So what is Fuchsia for? There have been a number of suggestions. Some people think it could be used to unify Chrome OS and Android into a single operating system, which is a plan that was first rumored last year, with the new OS set to be scheduled for a 2007 release. While others say it could be used to power hardware like Google on hub router or third-party Internet of Things devices. But what's most notable is Fuchsia is meant to ditch the Linux kernel which is Android based on, in favor of company's own code. So why? Why is Google quietly developing a brand new OS and kernel with support for smartphones and PC, possibly built with material design in mind? The most obvious guess and most exciting is that Google hopes to one day replace Chrome OS and Android with Fuchsia. But perhaps Google will treat Fuchsia like Samsung treats Tizen OS a lightweight OS used on hardware not suited for full-blown Android. Google's collection of embedded hardware such as OnHub router and Google Home is going. Perhaps Fuchsia is only being developed for devices like these. Will Android be replaced by Fuchsia? Some samples of code indicate Fuchsia is going to be used in embedded systems, which is things that are specialized and don't need an actual operating system. Fuchsia is also said to be designed for modern phones and PCs that are working, slacking when it comes to specs. Graphic rendering is also meant to be part of new software, which has put more fuel to the fire that this will be used in tandem with augmented reality Google is working on. Fuchsia is being developed, of course, and so even Google is probably uncertain of what part it will play in its future. For now, though, all we can do is speculate on this new OS, feel free to do exactly that with us in comments below and please subscribe my channel.